Heyo, Thallion here, and welcome back to Pocket Mirror. Now, this time when we go into the weird, creepy horror house of mazes, I'm gonna be very careful to try to not run into- Oh, whoa, what, what, already, what, already? Are you kidding me? Is this just a rinse and repeat thing? There was no indicator there that she would be there. There was no indicator. There was none. Okay, I see how it's gonna be. It's gonna be a going back and forth time thing where I gotta guess all the time. I see how it is, okay? Fine. Fine. Okay, first things first, I'm, what is this? Acquired a rusty pair of scissors, okay. And Jurassic, oh god, oh god, oh god. Chasing, chasing, where do I go, where do I go, where do I go? Loop around, loop around, I guess. Does this work, does this work? Oh god, uh, uh, oh, wait, this is going back the way I came, is there a way? Oh! Oh, I see. Oh, what's that? What's the rustling? Where's the rustling? Where is it, uh, this way? I don't know, I don't know where I'm going, oh no. Hello? Hello? Oh god, I... Is there anybody here? Oh, where is this a dead end? Oh god, wait. Wait, there's no reflection here. Interesting. I'm gonna click on Oh, this one has no reflection. Is this what I need to do? Or go through, just go through, whatever. Okay, so if I had veered off to the edge there, would I have gotten caught by somebody? Or would that would have would that have been fine? Hello? Oh, it's a it's this but I didn't save. But I didn't save. What am I supposed to do? I didn't save. Which way do I go? Which way do I go? Where do we go, George? Where do we go? No, okay, that's fine, I see. Anything? Anything? I got, okay, so am I looking for another mirror without a reflection? Hello? Okay, let's back this up. Am I screwed? Is that how this go? Anything without a reflection? Oh, no, okay. So they were just trying to herd me. I gotta be careful not to run directly into the Lisette clones. They will guide me where I need to go. I need to stay. Was there a reflection there? There was. Darn it. Thing is, darn it. Anything here? No. Oh, what, what was this? Hi, hi, hi. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back, why don't we? Yeah, that seems like a good idea. Where do I go? Everything has a reflection. That seemed like a special event. I wonder what happened. Is it- how do I get out of this place? Is it like the other one? Hi? I keep hearing like doors open and it's the worst. Is there anything without a reflection? Anything at all? And- Hello? You're different. This one has no reflection. Okay. Wait, wasn't that- that's like right next to where everything was. Let's just go right through- Oh! Hello! Hi! A mirror with chains! Okay. Alice in Chains, get it, because it's an Alice in Wonderlandy game. Even though, even though it was stated as such, I haven't, I used to get that vibe from it, but I don't anymore. Like, it's not, it doesn't, apart from the going down the rabbit hole of madness, it hasn't been very, like, Alice intersected, if that makes sense. Lisette, oh, she's all chained up. And she's at the bottom of a well, I like that. I finally found you. I don't, you're, I don't think she's happy to see me. You're Lisette, aren't you? Uh, aren't you tired of making a fool of yourself? What? What do you expect to gain from all this? What more could you even want from me at this point? Lisette, that's not what I... Then what is it? You always say no. <laughs> oh, you always say this isn't what you meant to do. Then what is it? What is it that you mean to do when you read... Or what is it that you meant to do when you read that letter? I... She makes a good point. Yeah, look at that smile. Look at that smug smile. She makes a good point. Perdakis has a whole lot of I didn't mean to when she does things, but that isn't necessarily... I think that's unfair in a lot of ways. Um, yes, yeah, she obviously means to do stuff. That's what you are. I think it's a G... I can't tell. Somebody in the comments said that I already guessed the name, so I guess it's one of the names that I went through earlier. You're nothing but a filthy hypocrite. No, said I... Oh, I'm not... <laughs> Oh, can this even be reconciled? Did Harpe tell you so? Huh? I envy you, blah, 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 blah. I do would like to play innocent and escape. But you can't, you're a scapegoat. Just like you. Oh, but you're chained here. You're right, Lisette. That's all I've done until now. Don't give her that dorky smile. That's not all you've done, you filthy liar. Lisette, shut up. Oh, everything's shattering. What have you come here to do? To act like Flita and scorn me? Or act like Harpe and scold me? No, Lisette, I... I came here to understand you. 
What is there to understand? Hmm? What is there to understand about Lisette? Oh, I wanted to see you with my own eyes. Not Flita's or Harpe's. Liar. I don't want to hide behind their backs anymore. I want to understand you and to understand myself. Is that so? <laughs> then what about that little angel of yours? Are you going to try and understand her too? <laughs> oh, that's she's talking about Angel. Oh, man. I'm not going to fall for it, Glubba Glock. Lisette, listen. I'm tired of listening to the likes of you. Oh, gosh. Don't act like you're ready to atone for your sins. Oh, that's such an interesting imagery. Oh, I love it. How pitiful can you get? I don't understand. Of course you don't. <laughs> you will never understand any of this. You're as hopeless as I am, don't you see? There's no way out. You're going to lose to him no matter how hard you try. So the him, I'm assuming, is referring to Demon Boy, which, um... It was pointed out in the comments, thank you, Melody, for clearing up the fact that the Demon Boy was likely making a deal with Lisette's mother, Elise. Or not Lisette, excuse me. Uh, the protagonist's mother, Elise, not Harpe. Um, that was my bad. I, I just, I looked at the model real quick and I made a poor decision. But yeah, no, the mother makes way more sense in the context. So why bother? No. Give me the pocket mirror. I will end it for us so you won't have to. You're going to shatter us. Give it to me. No! You ignorant child! How selfish can you be? Why won't you put me out of my misery? Why do you keep holding on to that ridiculous curse? Do you not understand what Elise did to you? Oh, we're getting into the... Oh, we're getting into him. Stop holding on to our words and let the pocket mirror go! No! Hmm. I will not give up. I may not know who I am. And the heart may be weak, and sometimes it may be in, give in. But I know now, more than ever, that Kingdom Hearts is light. Oh, God damn it! God damn it. I couldn't stop. I couldn't stop myself. I'm sorry. I need to collect myself. Oh, a serious moment of the game. Moment of the game ruined. And just like you said, I may not understand anything. Stop pretending. But I want to know. Who I am, who you are, and what I'm doing here. Hmm. She's not laughing anymore. How righteous of you. No. I'm not righteous at all. I'm just a coward. Mo? Oh? I'm nothing but a coward. I couldn't save Flita or Harpe. I locked you away along with my secrets. All I ever did was pretend, and even Angel. Oh, you know. Does the protagonist know? Oh, does she know the nature of Angel? Even I might just be part of this delusion. Oh, Lisette. Oh, the darkness is cleared. This might have all been useless. I may lose to him in the end or even give in to you, but I don't. Lisette, just for a little longer, let me. I'm not the one you want to say those words to. Lisette. I really am the worst in you. No. Oh, okay. Thank you, Lisette. Are you going to chatter? Oh. Goodbye. She's letting me pass. Oh, that's the end. Oh, was that the end of Lisette? Oh, my heart. So we gotta go on to the Demon Boy and I assume to Angel. Yeah, we're going away. There are crosses in the background. This is an interesting hellscape in the background. It looks like the epitome of Discord. Are we climbing Calvary? Is that the imagery here? Oh, we're climbing Calvary to where Lisette lies. Oh, with a moon overhead. The moon has had some interesting imagery here in this game as well that I hadn't picked up on really until now. I'm here, Lisette. I finally found you. Blah, 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 blah. I wish you would just say my name. You know my name. Although I can't hear it, I can tell. 
Lisette, I... I just want to tell you I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh. Oh, together they cry. Lisette, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Lisette. Oh, for everything she put her through, for the misery that she made Lisette endure because she was weak. Because she couldn't own up to what she was doing. I'm so sorry I did this to you. At least from this inner perspective of the mind, she was weak. At least in her eyes. Please forgive me. I will atone for my sins in your stead. All of them. I just... I wish I could have gotten to know you. Oh, me too. Oh, Lisette, before I go, I... Oh. <laughs> I want to tell you that I love you. I love you just as much as Harpe and Fleeta. Oh, she's accepting a part of herself that she wanted to reject and cast away and isolate. This is the, the acceptance of the worst in her, as Lisette said. Oh, I should let you rest. Oh, dear Lisette. Thank you, Lisette, for everything you've done for me. I won't... I won't forget you. I'm not forgetting anymore. Thank you. Oh. Such a beautiful scene. Wow. And I'm guessing this is her regalia. So yeah, we got the good ending. I don't know what the bad ending is. I don't know if I want to see the bad ending after this. Lisette's regalia. I don't think I want to see the bad ending after all this. I, I think it would break my heart too much. Oh, hello, weird hallway. I do want to take a look at Lis uh, Lisette's regalia real quick, which is the Schnee Schneer, the Schnee Shear. A pair of delicate golden scissors engraved on one of its blades is the letter L. So yeah, so it fits the whole idea of her name being related to gold. So I guess we have to press on now to what I imagine could be the final world. I'm not entirely sure. Um, I kind of get that impression that we are going to the very end of the game. Oh, I got pumpkin charms. I don't know why I just decided to search, but whatever, that works. I guess I can use pumpkin charms. Hello? <gasps> Felita! Egliette! Oh, my darlings! Hello! After all this time, no! Don't go! Is Harpe here too? Harpe! Can I enter those rooms with them? Or are they... Or are these... Oh, I can't. This is compartmentalizing them in her mind. That or assimilating. Like, I think this is meant to show... Oh, and Lisette... How they're all in separate corners of her mind, but now they're all part of the same house. The same establishment. The same being. The shattered mind of our protagonist is finally being made whole. A perfect mirror. What if I continue over here? Wait, which way do I go? Which way do I go? Which way leads to victory? Oh, this is just leads to darkness. Okay. But over here, this is the way we have to go. Oh, pumpkin charms. I imagine there are pumpkin charms in all of these, uh, all of these things. I wouldn't be surprised if there was one here as well. Yep, exactly. Perfect. But this is such a beautiful imagery. They're all finding peace here in the mind. Oh, I love this game so much. We're back to Creepsterville. Okay, I should have expected this to come back very quickly. Old wooden boxes lay empty in the corner. Put to sleep under a light sheet of dust. Uh, what else do we have? What else is in here? Can I get some light, please? An old oak spinning wood with a sharpened needle. Well, thank you for the pumpkin charms, at least. That's fun. I imagine that there's a mirror up here at... Yeah, pull it down. Let's see the mirror. And let's talk to Angel, if I'm right. Oh, hi. Thank you for the glowy light flower things. Hello, Angel. It's been a while. We made it through Lasalle, right? Angel. It's time, Angel. Yes. Oh, so are we crossing through? Is this where we needed to go? Oh, this is neat. Oh, what? Hello? 
Oh, okay. I thought I was watching a theater. I thought we were going directly into Angel's theater. Oh, Angel! Hi! I can't believe we're finally together! Yes. I'm so glad I can finally meet you. Me too. Hi, how are you doing? I'm glad you got here safely. Yes, me too. This is an interesting world you've brought us into though, Angel. So this is where you've been all this time. Yes, it's a pretty disgraceful place to be, don't you think? I've been trapped here ever since I can remember. I've tried looking for exits, but I haven't gotten too far. I see. But we're together now, right? Yeah, but am I trapped in this strange world with her? I'm sure we'll make it out of here. You're really positive, aren't you? Of course. <laughs> I finally found you, right? Now I don't have to be afraid anymore. Right. Well then, let's go. I'm sure we'll be able to find an e exit now that we're together. Are you going to try to steal my body? Is that what's going to happen here? I wouldn't like that very much. Hmm. I still don't trust Angel at all, especially after seeing her interact with Lisette. Ooh. Like, maybe she just didn't want me to die, but still. Let's talk to her. You know, Angel, I've been thinking. When we get out of this place, I'd like to do all sorts of fun things with you. Fun things? Yes. Things like going to parties, taking walks in the park, and drink tea. Aw. Wait, walk in the park, parties, drink tea. Those are all... Those were all activities we did with Fleeta. Doesn't it sound fun? What's so funny? I never thought you'd like that kind of thing. Why not? Because I like them too. Huh. Oh, that's an interesting reaction. And Jill, you're so silly. Also, I'd like to take a moment. I, I didn't notice this before, but she has a ribbon tied around her hand and in the way that she's cupping, like, because that's how the, where the protagonist cups her pocket mirror. But it looks like the ribbon has something tied off. It's almost like bandages. It's hard to tell, which is very odd. We're the same person. Of course, we'd like the same things. You're right. I almost forgot about that. Uh, not that I trust it or anything. So let's continue on. Do you have anything else to say? And Jill, hmm, what's wrong? I was just thinking about how you said you'd lost track of time. It must have been hard to be here all on your own. It was, but talking to you made everything better. Oh, Angel. It's fine, Angel. Come here. Oh, are we hugging? Oh, okay, I thought we were gonna have a hug, which is all I wanted. I promise everything will be all right. Oh, I know. Thank you, Angel. I guess we might as well continue. Wait. Oh, and I'm controlling Angel, not the protagonist right now. Hi. Hello. Okay, let me go ahead and let me put it into this save file. I'm trying to decide if I should end the episode here or if I should continue on. Hmm. Let's continue on for now. Um, I think we're getting close to think at the next save point, I'll probably save. I think we have a little bit of this world left and I want to save the next episode for all of the endings, all of the main endings in the game. Um, Assuming that this is only going to take two episodes. I'll, I'll look up the general flow of the game. The, in, unimportant. But I'll try to, like, make it ma make sense in a reasonable manner. These are mirrors I used to reach you. They're very large mirrors, actually. Really? It must have been lonely. Yes, it was. But it's nothing compared to what you went through just to find me. That was... It might have been hard, but I think it helped me get to know myself a little better. <laughs> I'm grateful to have met them. You really are positive. Yes. Does that make her negative? Is that the thing? Are they are they mirror images of each other? It's courageous to tell the truth, or contagious. <laughs> she just said contagious, not courageous. Interesting. Well, let's continue on. Hello. Oh, and that's the end of that. So let's move up through here. But I like this. I like this aesthetic. I love the art direction in this game. It's really fantastic, especially for an RPG Maker horror game, or an RPG Maker game in general, which a lot of RPG Maker games... See, there's the moon again. Um, take stock assets a lot, but this seems to have so many, like, unique art assets that were made just for this game. What's this? I don't know. It wasn't here before. It wasn't? So did you just have this, like, one strip of red carpet to run around on, Angel? Maybe we should find another way to reach the other side. It'll be alright, Angel. We're together now, right? We don't have to be afraid of anything anymore. That's right. You sure are positive. I just feel more reassured to have you here with me, that's all. Is that so? Yes. Let's go. So yeah, she keeps saying, you sure are positive. And when a game repeats that over and over again, so definitely, it makes you think that there's some ulterior motive. So if I'm so positive, I'm the little goody two-shoes. Lisette was like the other side of that in a way, but also, I wonder if Angel is like, she keeps saying, you're so positive. Is Does that mean Angel is all negative? Like we are like mirror images of each other. She's a little bit darker. I don't know. This is interesting. 
I will never trust Angel. Even if she, at the end of the game, she proves herself to be a valuable asset, I will never trust Angel. Because anybody that looks like me is not to be trusted. Never. <laughs> We're so high up. It's a bit like a carousel, don't you think? A carousel? Yes. The one with the horses. Oh, right. Of course. Do you not remember anything? Angel, I was wondering. Hmm. Are you afraid of heights? <laughs> of course not. Huh, interesting. I'm sorry, Angel. I was a little, a little lost in thought. Is something bothering you? Of course not. I'm just happy to have you here with me, that's all. Angel, I'm so relieved. Relieved? I'm just glad I found you. I'm happy I got to meet you. Me too. This is really interesting. Like, it feels like Angel's struggling to keep up this... I don't know. I, it feels like she's struggling to, like, keep the attention on the protagonist and keep up this idea of friendship. I don't know. This is very interesting. There are so many stars here. They're pretty. I really like them. I'm sure Fleeta does too. Fleeta? Yes. She likes sparkly things. I see. Oh, is she getting jealous? she getting a little jelly? Oh, is she getting all the, the grape jelly? Hey, Angel. Yes. We will always be together from now on, won't we? What? Of course we will. Probably. Maybe. Of course we will, Angel. I can promise you that, even though you never make promises like that. Angel. You're right. I don't think that you should have made that promise. She's going to get really mad at you later when you have to break it. Okay, let's continue on. Apart from the carousel ride in the stars in space. Why did we go to space? Why did we go to space? So let's continue on over here. Hi, pumpkins. Oh, these actually talk. What is life without a good laugh once in a while, don't you think? These are pumpkins. Oh, what about them? They never say anything. That's because you never tried to talk to us in the first place. What? Oh, see? See, that means, so, she, Angel's trying to put herself off, like, as the same as the protagonist, but the protagonist talks very openly to pumpkins. Most pumpkins are really nice once you talk to them. Now, that's the truth right there, miss. Is that so? Anyway, we should... Hey, do you girls want to hear a joke? We'd love to. Right, Angel? Oh, uh, yeah, sure, why not? Yeah, she's very apathetic. All right, then, here it goes. Can you tell me what is the most musical bone? Burr, I, I want a drum roll or something. But what is it, Mr. Pumpkin? The trombone! Oh, it actually did the thing. It actually did the chidupong. I love it. What's so funny? Get it? It's a trombone. Oh, I like it. I don't get it. <laughs> it's all right if you don't have a sense of humor. I won't judge. Let's go, Angel. Yes, let's. Good. Apparently, little Angel over there does not have any sense of humor whatsoever. Oh, hi. Is this Fleeta? Or is this Harpe? This is strange. What's the matter, Angel? This wasn't here before, this long carpet. What do you mean? There used to be a parlor right ahead. Excuse me. We should go back. We, we must have missed a turn. Let's go? Why should we go back? We came all the way here, right? Let's just keep going. I'm sure we'll get somewhere if we follow this path. What are you saying? Didn't I just... Didn't I say I don't remember this path? But we're looking for an exit and you haven't found one, so screw you. It might be dangerous to go any further. Well, you're right, but... But? I'm more accustomed to this place than you are, but you just said you earlier you couldn't find an exit. It makes more sense for me to be the one that guide us. It does, but I don't think going back will do any better than following this path. That's all. Fine. You lead the way first, and if it doesn't work that well, we'll just go back. How about it? All right. Let's go, then. I can just imagine her for the great teeth. This fucking thinks just because she's the protagonist, she can say everything. I don't know. Hello. Oh, so see, see, here is Angel and the protagonist. Beautiful. And I like how Angel has the little wing thing. The little wing-a-ding. What's this? Well, it's clearly you two. Was this here before? No, no, it wasn't. This might mean we're close. <laughs> right? I hope that's the case. I kind of skipped by really quick. What's happening? Something go wrong? I don't know. Maybe it's best if we go back. Ooh. Did something collapse? Oh, crap. Hola. Oh, crap. What's going on? Hello? 
Did something happen? Oh, there goes our road. I guess we have to go through this magical pumpkin door. Okay, so look at this. It says Golden Lugan? Golden Lugan? A Golden. It's like a Pokemon. A Golden Lugan. Was this not here before either? Oh, it has it has Angel in one tower and our protagonist in the other. Angel? No, it wasn't. Oh, this is interesting. Do I have to go through all those doors? This is super neat. I love it. It's fine, Angel. I'm sure it'll be all right. You don't understand. This is one of his games. Do you mean... Ah, crap. So it's interesting. When she says his, there's a pumpkin door. Angel? <laughs> Let's go. I'll explain it later. You lead the way. I'll follow after you. <laughs> Hold my hand, then. I don't want you to fall behind. Hmm... Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and save here, and I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. I am oh, I did not mean to save in that file. Oops. Okay. Well, hopefully there wasn't anything important there, or we might be screwed. But anyways, this has been Pocket Mirror. In the next episode, it might be the last one. It might be the one after that. I'm not quite sure. I'll have to see. But hopefully, I want to go through and get all of the main endings for you. I think there's like four of them or something, and we'll see how that goes. But anyways. Thank you, everybody, for watching. If you like this video, please hit that like button, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Valian, out. Oh no! Why does why does Red have a horse with the tent? What? Friend, no. I need that half. Here, I want you to have my old piston rod. I don't want Willie's rod. I don't want his old rod. I don't think Angel likes the same things I do as much as she pretends to. I think she's trying to trick me.